In this video let's learn about PWM at pulse width modulation. Arduino can only give digital outputs that is either high or low. But it can simulate an analog output using PWM. In PWM we turn the digital output signal on and off very fast. We can vary the voltage output between 0 volt and 5 volts by varying the time for which the digital output signal is high and the time for which the digital output signal is low. For example, when the signal is on for 50% of the time and off for 50% of the time, the voltage will be half of 5 volts, which is 2.5 volts. Similarly, when the signal is on for 25% of the time and off for 75% of the time, the voltage will be 25% of 5 volts, which is 1.25 volts. Let us control the brightness of an LED by giving a PWM output to it. Let us slowly fade the LED from off to partially on to completely on. The Arduino Uno has 6 PWM pins 3, 5, 6, 9, 10 and 11. Connect an LED to pin 9. Now let's program the code. Declare an LED at pin 9. Set the pin as an output device. Now, to give an analog output value, we use a method called analog write. Analog write takes two parameters, the pin number and the output value. The output value ranges from 0 to 255. If the give a value of 255, the LED will light up at maximum brightness. At 125, the LED will light up at around half the brightness. At 0, the LED will be off. Let us gradually increase and decrease the brightness of the LED. We will use a for loop and delay method to establish this. In the first for loop, we will slowly raise the brightness of the LED from 0 to 255 keeping variable I as the counter. In the second for loop, we will slowly lower the brightness of the LED from 255 to 0 keeping variable J as the counter. Let's compile and upload the code. As you can see, the LED brightness is gradually increased and decreased. PWM can be used in various other applications like controlling motor speed. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel for more useful content. Thanks and see you in the next video.